featuring the nation's funniest comedians each and every weekend. Out of respect for the performers, there's absolutely no recording of this show. Please silence all cell phones and keep talking to a minimum. Thank you. And now, please put your hands together and give a big round of applause for our first performer of the evening. Vegetarian. 
<laughs> I don't know where I failed him. <laughs> uh, I hurt my back, uh, and you know, the drugs they give you are great. <laughs> it's the only reason why I'm up here tonight, because I'm too high to know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> But the doctor told me that I needed to strengthen my core. So I went online and I started doing all this research and I, I started finding out about Pilates and about crunches and yoga and then I discovered something. I just read that women, that women can actually do an exercise called Kegel to strengthen their vaginal muscles. I was so embarrassed when I read that. Because all my life I thought Kegel was a noodle pudding you got on the Jewish holidays. <laughs> Do you know when, when I think back to all those Passover seders when I would go up to one of my female relatives and go, Mmm, Aunt Lois, your Kegel is delicious. Don't record me. It's no one you should never just like I to record you. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get to the police. Uh, and uh, let's see, oh yeah, the other thing I wanted to mention tonight, I was watching, uh, oh, my friends actually think that it's scary to do this at my age. In fact, they, they think that to do anything at my age is scary. <laughs> Getting out of bed is scary. I mean, you can fall down and break a hip, and it's that scary. Has anybody bought a new bed recently or, or, or slipped? The new beds come out, I just bought one. The, the mattresses are three and a half feet high. They come on a platform that's two and a half feet high. Alright? You need to, and the ladder to get in. Okay, I don't sleep on a, a comfort top, I sleep on a, on a mountain top. My bed is so high that when my wife snores, it bounces off the walls like she's fucking yodeling. We had to put a stripper pole in our bed just so I could slide down in the mornings. Occasionally, I do dance for myself. Oh, don't kill me. Now, I, uh, I like to gamble a little bit, and uh, I was watching uh, the New York State Lottery the other day. Uh, anybody who played a lot in the numbers, right? Woo! Uh, there you go. So, I was watching the Alaska Vega. The Alaska Vega. She's a pinup girl for the New York State Lottery. So, uh, in the middle of her set, she goes, and the New York State Lottery is a proud sponsor of the National Gambling Problem Awareness Month. <laughs> so the first thing I said is, I bet you $500, I don't have a problem. <laughs> and then I said, you know, that's like going out and having a beer with your AA sponsor. <laughs> or, even, or even worse, you know, having a Weight Watchers at a Dunkin' Donuts. You know, just, anyway, we have a great show for you tonight. There's uh, a lot of comedy coming in your way. Oh, by the way, as I said before, everybody's going to have five minutes, except for, there's one exception. If you are up here juggling, and you have a knife and an axe, you can have all the time you fucking want. <laughs> Uh, comic for the evening that's coming up here. Uh, I actually haven't uh, seen him before, but I understand he's a, a very funny.